Now to your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast, meteorologist Stephen Metrano. Absolutely nice day today, Stephen. Yeah, Mike, temperatures topped out right around 50 degrees. We saw some sun and clouds, but not too bad. Nice way to start off the work week here. Now we are tracking some showers, though, in our forecast, especially for Tuesday and Wednesday. We'll time it all out in just a second. First, let's take a look outside. This is the capital city of Providence. And again, things are looking good. Nice glow in the sky here. Uh, we'll have increasing clouds for later on tonight, but we should stay rain free uh, through your Monday evening. Temperatures right now in the 40s all across the board, 45 down in Newport, 46 seven up in Providence and 46 in Smithfield. Again, these temperatures will drop as we go through tonight into tomorrow morning down to the mid 30s. So three key things going forward. The mild weather that we've been seeing does continue over the next couple of days, but we are also tracking showers at times with those warmer temperatures. And then we look to see finally a little bit of a dose of reality coming back to us for the end of the week with some cooler temperatures coming back. Satellite and radar things are OK for now. Some clouds and sunshine. That's really about it. Of course, the sun is setting now and we're looking at dry conditions, though, through this evening into Tonight, clouds will be on the increase, though, as we head into the overnight hours. Larger view shows storm system off to our west. And this will eventually be the reason why we see some showers coming to our area as we head into our Tuesday. So let's time it all out for you. Again, quiet tonight. Notice how this is uh, midnight tonight. We're still generally on the clear uh, side, but we're going to be seeing those clouds slowly increase by tomorrow morning. Here's about 8 o'clock in the morning. A few scattered uh, areas of drizzle, but that's really about it for the morning hours. I think the bulk of the rain does hold off until about 11 or 12 o'clock tomorrow uh, midday. So we're looking at 1 o'clock in the afternoon. Notice how uh, we're seeing some of the uh, brighter colors here approach us as we go through the early afternoon hours. Staying wet and soggy right into the afternoon, into the evening commute. And notice, though, the clouds hang on as we go into tomorrow night, but the first round of rain exits. So so that's what we're talking about rounds of rain and it's not going to be an all-out washout uh, look for sc uh, scattered showers for tomorrow though overall taking things in closer for tonight again temperatures backing into the mid 30s clear skies to start we'll see those clouds increase during the overnight hours and into tomorrow again maybe a scattered a scattered shower early on that's about it the bulk of the rain holds off until midday you can see those brighter colors come on through here temperatures topping out upper 40s low 50s for tomorrow afternoon and again that first round works through uh, just in time for tomorrow night and then we see cloudy skies continue with more showers coming in for our Wednesday so again back backtracking tonight temperatures in the mid 30s increasing clouds clear cool winds southwest around 5 to 10 for tomorrow morning heading out to work you can see here temperatures starting out somewhat on the chilly side in the mid 30s but then we rise to 45 with that rain approaching for the afternoon seven day forecast of course we are looking at that cool down coming our way because after all it is now January and we're seeing our temperatures spike up though on Wednesday with more showers by midweek potentially ending as a light mix later Friday as the storm system kind of meanders and then eventually moves on through. But with that, we're looking at much cooler temperatures coming in for Friday, Saturday and Sunday back into the upper 30s and low 40s. Mike.